All right, kiddo, what are the three different types of effects that we've been learning? I'm gonna keep asking, and one day you're gonna remember. That is not the joke. <laughs> <laughs> openers, tweeners, closers. Openers get the attention, tweeners build up value, and closers are where you get the free drinks or whatever it is you want. So, mm -hmm. for this closer, it's a challenge that hopefully will frustrate you. Mm, here are all the matches in the world, right? Yep. Here is a barn that is designed to cover the matches. Mm -hmm. uh, let's say it's about to rain. The goal is to get the barn over the matches so they are protected from the rain. However, number one, you cannot touch anything. And number two, you cannot leave your seat. Is everything I need already Everything on the you table? need is right there. Oh, that, that is a good point. You don't need to like, you know, you, you know, look, I'm not touching anything. Don't, okay. Yeah, do, don't do that. Don't do that. Uh, but, <laughs> but again, uh, all we want to do is make sure that we end up with the barn effectively shielding the matches from the rain. I can't touch the matches either. That's correct. Right? Okay. Yeah, yeah, you don't need to touch anything. So go ahead, experiment, try it. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, and I guess I'll reset it as many times as you want. <laughs> He's going the wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, Barn, you have one job. <laughs> hey, why does it go that way? <laughs> I think, I think my favorite part is the pause beforehand, like you're trying to psych it out. Oh, yeah, I am. <laughs> Why does it keep Look, going? It's down? already starting to rain. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, can I move this off here? Yeah. <laughs> okay, you know what? That is not bad. However, I'm gonna say that the only reason this is here is because we don't have- I can't have... move the whole table. Exactly. If you yeah. could, at the bar, just like lift up a table and hook out. You would give a drink. But I'll pick up your whole tab because I'm scared <laughs> of anyone who can do that. Oh my God. But that's the other thing about closers is you gotta be patient and you gotta reset it as many times as they like. If I set this on fire, will it float and then I can make it go over? Um. Maybe, but then you'll have a bard that's on fire. <laughs> now you're right, because this is a match puzzle, oftentimes the answer is just always set fire. something on fire. Yeah, exactly. I'm gonna try one more time. <laughs> wrong way. Why don't you think that's working? What do you think is going wrong there? I don't know why it's going this way for no reason. So I can't touch it. I can't use anything. Can I use anything else to touch you? Uh, this is where I use squirrely language and I say, you don't need anything. You have everything you need. You don't need any outside objects. See, that's, you, you don't want to touch things with other things. Hmm. And you are right. Whenever somebody sets up a bar bet and it involves the phrase and you can't touch anything, almost always the answer involves blowing on something. Oh, that's wild. I'm trying to see if that works, but it's not helping. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Like well, no, you do not get to change the setup. <laughs> okay, so it has to be like that. Yeah. Darn it. Okay. You'll notice that's part of why I said you can't leave your seat, because otherwise you could just get up and then blow this in there from the other side. Oh, not smart. Smart to say. If I can't touch it, I mean, Captain Obvious, but if I can't touch it, I can't do anything other and the blowing makes it go that way, so I can't even do anything. Um. Yep, anytime you want to take her easy, <laughs> you let me know. I'm gonna borrow your hat. I'm gonna wear it until... <laughs> I'm gonna wear this until you earn it from me. I tried. Maybe this time it would work. You just want to sneak up on it, don't you? <laughs> I do. I'm like, I'm like creepy crawling. Are you giving up or no. you, you want to keep going? Oh, that's good. I like your fighting spirit. Go in the barn. <laughs> <laughs> You're trying to coax the cattle back in. You're like, yeah. come on, babies. Yes, come on. Exactly. Get in the barn. I'm going to make a stick figure dog and make them herd <laughs> back in. Okay, fine. I give up. What? But I sorry, still I, have I could, my I, pride. Sorry. Hold on. I, I, I couldn't hear you. I mean, I, let me put on. Sorry. You, you, were, you, were, you were saying what again? Okay, fine. I give up. Oh, good. Good, good, good. <laughs> that means you have to toast. What I love about this particular closer is that it feels like you're just one more attempt away from getting it right. You always felt like you're on the right track. Yeah. But the problem, of course, is when you blow on this, and I'll set it up for me this time, pretty much no matter how you angle it, this guy's gonna go all crazy. No matter what, this guy just gets farther away and this guy goes sideways. Yeah. So 
Same setup. What were the rules again? You can't touch anything. You won't need to use any other objects. Squiggly, squiggly. And? And... Can I leave my seat? No, you cannot either. Are you ready? <laughs> what? Oh! <laughs> That's pretty good, right? Totally fair. Why didn't I think about that? A good closer is right in front of you the entire time. Here, do you want to give it a try? Yes. It's very satisfying. So what you want to do is you want to blow right into the cup of your hand and let that air poof that forward. There, there we go. go. Toast, yeah. toast, toast. You know what you get to wear? You get to wear your hat. I get to wear my super cool hat. I don't know what it says about us as parents that we all had a big discussion and agreed. Yeah. That those were the letters to be embroidered. And everybody was just like, yep.